this particular uh, images here comes by courtesy of NASA at the Jet Propulsion Laboratory and we are talking here about a planet that is disintegrating uh, near to the Sun and the name of, of the title here is Possible New Found Alien Planet is Falling to Pieces. Now the, uh, the star is named KIC 12557548 and um, there's a planet there which is about the size of um, Mercury, I believe. Now, uh, this particular uh, planet is like a comet and it's disintegrating. Now, uh, the, 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 the temperature of, of this planet uh, is surface is at 3600 degrees Fahrenheit or 1982 degrees Celsius, all right? And it's a, disintegrating just like a uh, like a comet. And according to researchers, uh, the, 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 they say that uh, under these conditions, the planet rocky material melts and evaporates, creating a trail, a, a training wind of gas and dust in space. Um, now I, w I wanted to uh, bring this up because I got another issue here to talk about, and it has to do with comets. But let's say what. Uh, uh, the scientist side. Astronomers using NASA's Kepler Space Telescope have found evidence for what might be a tiny planet disintegrating under the searing heat of its host star. Dust and gas ejected from the planet's surface seem to be forming a comet-like tail of trailing material. The tail can change dramatically even over a single 15-hour orbit. Kepler finds planets by searching for the slight drop in brightness seen as they pass in front of their stars. Usually, that drop is constant, but in this system, the variation seen from orbit to orbit hints at a dusty tail trailing a doomed world. Now, this one is Comet Lovejoy. Okay, so let's see. Now this is Comet Lovejoy and as you can see it's, it's been hit by all these flares and everything and, if, and the tail, the tail is surviving and so does the comet. The comet eventually went around the other way to survive another day. Anybody care to answer this question? You can see it's surviving the extreme temperature, there's flares here. I mean if this was the position of the earth at this extreme Temp uh, closeness, uh, we would have seen already the mass oceans evaporated, uh, all the ice disappear from the from the other images of that mysterious planet. Well, you still believe that uh, comets are just snowballs? I'd like to hear your views on that. Thank you for watching, Sangsta One.